Welcome all. We are back at American Falls. And uh, just taking a look. Look at our greenhouse. It is rocking here. We've got all kinds of lettuce sitting there. I don't know in how much in storage. Uh, about 1,500 liters. So that's not bad. I think these are in stacks of five across the back here. So there's 20, probably 30, almost 30,000 liters of lettuce at about three grand a pop. That is pretty good. Our cows, hello ladies. They are actually producing this milk. We've got about 4,500 liters of milk, which is sweet. I've been waiting a long time for that milk. Now, first thing we need to do is we have two fields that we need to get some fertilizer put on. We've got our field right over here, number eight. We just put soybeans in there. They're on their first growth state. They do have one application of fertilizer and field, uh, what is it, 27? We just put that in the ground. So it needs two fertilizer applications. Let's hop in here. So I wanted to get that done first thing so we can move on to bigger and better things. I am hoping that we can buy some more land in this episode. Now, I don't know how much money we're gonna have. Right now, we've got about 94,000 bucks, which on this map is not much. So we definitely are gonna need some more money uh, and along with some more fertilizer. Oh yeah, we've got plenty. That bag held 6,500 liters, I think it was when we bought it. So this should fill this guy up no problem at all. But I don't know if we're gonna be selling anything this month or we're gonna be waiting till next month. I think the lettuce is next month. Oh, I did look over at our sugar mill over there and that has like four or five pallets of sugar and that can be sold. It is still going for like 1500 bucks per thousand liters, which I think is, is still pretty darn good. It's I think it tops out in the 1500s. So it's gonna do nothing but drop after this. So I say we definitely sell some sugar before we move on out of December into January. But other than that, I'm not really sure what is good for December. Maybe sorghum? I don't know, we'll take a look. Let's go ahead, let's get these fields banged out. We can get this done and then move on to hopefully uh, making some money. There we go, pretty quick and painless. Fertilizing isn't too bad. I mean, they have some spreaders that go like 42 meters. That would make really short work out of every field we have, like two passes and that would be it. I would still miss pieces, I'm sure I would, just like this. Okay, now that is done. So I think we should do what? Let's go back, maybe we will sell some sugar. Or do we want to give the sheep a little bit of grass? I'm, or actually, I don't have any grass. We could only give them hay. But I think that would be all right. Let's do that. I do not want to forget to feed the sheep. I just don't want them running out of food as the night goes through. If they don't have any food, production shuts down and we don't make any money. Let's go drop this guy off right here. I buy this nice bag. That worked out well for us, it, right? There. Okay, and we need this trailer. Of course, that seed I dropped right in the middle. That's okay. Let's see. Maybe we can just... Nope. Get out of the barn, man. 
I think there's a way I can shut that off so it doesn't glitch through like that. I just don't know what it is. Oh, turn the wheels the right way. There we go. All right. Trying to steer and so I can see. And oh my God, it's a little almost too much for me. <laughs> just get the dang trailer. Uh, okay, next time I'll park it maybe not right in the middle. That'll be better. On some end, one or the other. Trays. And how much hay do we have? Uh, hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, never. It's a different time. And no, come on. Where is it? Jeez, there it is. Okay. How much we gonna get? Maybe 10,000 liters? Let's do 10,000 liters. Maybe that'll keep them happy for a while. And boom. Oh, 10,053. Not bad. I mean, that was pretty close. Go. Like back this up where I need it to be. I'm a little off, but that's okay. I've known that for years. I think they're okay for water. We'll check it, obviously. So let's uh let's go here. Chickens, how are they doing? They're dandy. Sheep. Uh oh yeah, they are gonna be just fine. Water, they've got eleven thousand liters. That's pretty good. I know the cows are good. Cows are real good. They just, they don't have any straw. I could give them some straw. Uh, I don't know if I want to give them straw or not, because if they, if I give them straw, then we get manure and then we have to deal with manure and slurry. Maybe we will just leave that as is for right now. And our productions, our wool is going. I mean, how much we, 180 liters. Okay. We have a little ways to go for fabric to be able to sell, but let us. Oh, they must have just... No, I thought they dropped another. Never mind. They're still storing about 1,500 liters sugar. And they are oh, almost ready to drop another pallet. So let's do that. Isn't sugar still going pretty good? Sugar, sugar. I don't want to go buy it. There it is. And yeah, we have 1,523 at Harris's garage. Now it is dropping fast, it looks like. Well, I don't know how fast, I guess. It's just dropping. I like eh, fast or slow or either way it is dropping so let me drop this trailer off and then i think we will grab our little baby trailer and go with it oh let's make this easier for us right next to the water trailer should be fine now we will grab this little guy uh, oh i almost still could have got it there was even the bad driving there we go okay that's better Wow, it's kind of nice to have no leaves on that tree. I can pull in here and be able to see. That does make things handy. So we should have another pallet dropping fairly soon. Unhook those. Let's grab you. Start loading these guys on here and we will make sure we get that last pallet before we go sell. So I sped up a little bit of time so that we could get this last pallet out of there. So now it is two o'clock in the afternoon, but with that, we now have six pallets of sugar. Beautiful. Should bring in quite a bit. I mean, what, 30,000 liters? That is nothing to sneeze at. So where, where are we going? Harris's garage, right? And, oh, actually the dairy has taken the lead. Speeding up time. Uh, swapped out Harris's garage for the dairy that's okay I know where the dairy is actually which is amazing I'm actually starting to learn this map and where things are now if memory serves me correct the dairy only takes so much so we will sell what we can here and then whatever is left we'll zip it down to Harris's garage no 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 don't 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 do that don't do that Woof. Got me a little panicked. Okay, so take what you will, Derry. And, and that's all you're going to take? Okay, I don't know that that was really worth driving down here. Is that all they took? That is, right? Ta-da! Yeah, okay. Well, 
and another zero dollars worth of products okay let's go down let's go to harris's garage we know they will buy it all they have one hell of a sweet tooth simmer down trailer let's gently too gently gently turn our butt into here would hate to flip over on the very last corner and go 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 look at that my goodness look at that money shoot up Thirty-seven thousand, very nice so we made what 42 grand almost 43 grand out of that man that is just that is just good money i think that took just one month to produce those five pallets was it five six pallets there we go i could i'll be able to do math someday or not but six pallets of sugar not bad at all so okay let's let's just cease and desist for just a moment what do we need to do we fertilize our fields all of our fields are good next month we will have to fertilize field 27 one more application but other than that everything is good how are we doing nothing is ready to harvest that's for sure now next month our grass fields will be ready to mow i think they are on the first ready to harvest steak right now yes yes yeah oh too far too far too far yeah okay so next month we will be able to mow the grass so i'm thinking i'm thinking we go ahead and move into january that will uh, allow us to sell some lettuce and i don't know if there's go oh maybe the sorghum wait a second i wanted to check on our sorghum that's what i was thinking I can't remember if that is this month or next month. Sorghum, where are you? 44,000 liters. And it's January. Are we in January? No, we're in December. So next month, get back in the tractor. So next month, it will be ready to sell. We can sell our sorghum as well, sell our lettuce. And then we are going to see what type of money we have and what type of fields we can afford to buy. Ooh, welcome to frigid January and it looks cold. Uh oh. Whoa, snow. <laughs> Just took a minute to catch up. That's all. Okay, well, that's a that's quite white, and I would imagine that would be quite cold. I mean, I don't I don't know where this is. Where is this map located? I don't even know what state. I'm only really familiar with Illinois weather and it's cold in Illinois. So where are we going? What are we doing? Let's check our lettuce. Uh, sorghum is well, we're here. Uh, 50, oh, 1608 at Falls Grain. That is, that's really good. Maybe we should just do that. And is what's that doing? That going up? No, that's going down. So let's let's do that right now. Let's go ahead and check her lettuce just to see where it's at. It should be on the good side as far as selling goes. We are 3287 and 3225 is top. All right, so we buy anything, we are going to have some money. Let's get in here, grab our big trailer. Oh man, what am I going to do with all of this? lettuce all i have is this little bitty trailer i think we might be renting ourselves a trailer drop you oh i don't want this one hold up hold up cut it off get into this one there we go this one goes faster and has a lot more horsepower so i think close not nah, qu not quite double but at least 100 hp more not the fastest loading thing ever but that's okay we are we're patient aren't we I, i'm not really patient that's a lie i am not patient at all so where where oh where where was i going i know i looked and i have already forgot mine like a steel sieve that's what it is and we are going to falls grain i don't even know if i know where that is be somewhere close that would be nice I mean, nowhere is too far away. Oh, okay. Right down here. And what is the best way to go? The train tracks would be the best way to go. But I guess we will go up this way. All right, let's do that. 
See if we can find our way through this maze to get to the big orange beacon. Orange? It's not orange. It's not. It's green. I'm I'm really not colorblind. But I guess, you know, orange, green. They're close. It's alright. Man, it dumps out right now. How much we get per trailer? 32,000. There we go. And we have another trailer full to go. Let me go grab that and uh, we will get another 32 grand. That's going to put us over the 200,000. And that's before we sell any lettuce. Oh, man. Oh, man. I am drooling. I am ready for a new field. My biggest thing is I don't know. I don't know how. Oh, my. Woo, man. That brings back memories. <laughs> up north winters oh yeah i remember that turn your wheels uh oh we're still going straight that's no bueno okay but i, I my concern is i just don't know how much to spend on a field because if we spend all of our money then we're broke again and we just sold most of our products 202 all right that is awesome now what do i want to do do i i know i'm gonna need a trailer for the lettuce now we could get old reliable and need, oh oh my now that's a slurry spreader but my 50 percent off it's still 60 grand i just can't do that but oh that's cool but this the lizard fertilizer spreader that is a beast it does what up to 24 meters which ours does 17. Uh, i don't know if it's really worth it it's one of my favorite spreaders but is it really worth it to get a few extra meters now it holds a whole bunch more fertilizer but right now we're not having issues with our spreader not holding enough and we don't need lime well I guess when is a good deal not a good deal when you don't need it so we will just forego that and what was i doing what was i doing why was i oh trailer trailer there we go Woo! okay and this is there I'm, I'm losing it i've lost it it's gone it was never here so we could go with this one which is just fine and we can put quite a few on there uh, I think that might just be the way to go. So let's get this and let's just lease it. 700 bucks. Yeah, that's fine. I don't have a hitch on the back of this, do I? Oh, I do. So I wonder, what are you doing? Get, no. Oh my God. Sometimes me and my fingers just do not see eye to eye. My fingers go one way. My brain says another and we end up doing that. <laughs> there no here yes there okay come on dude put it on a jacket it's cold so let's see if we can actually hook this one to that i think we can but we shall see i right, gotta be able to get it in here first Come on, baby, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Get it. It's only for transport. Come on. You should be. Uh, I'm thinking maybe it's not going to hook up. Okay, never mind. I guess I will go drop this trailer and then come back and grab that. How much can we fit on the trailer? I uh, I don't know. Oh, uh, let's no, don't do that. I would say we should get what? Maybe five across something. I guess let's just quit him hawing about it. Let's just see how much we can get on here. And this is with no uh, heavy lifting mods installed. I can just pick it up. I mean, lettuce isn't that heavy. Uh, turn 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 and using a controller the only problem i have with it is when you go to turn around it just takes so long uh, what was that oh 19 dollars in wage payments hey it's still dropping all right that's cool dropping us some new pallets so we can get three across 
probably maybe four along here something like that we've got one more pallet let's grab this guy and then let us see how much money we get wasn't that funny you see what i did there i know that joke has never ever been done before i am the first <laughs> the only maybe let's let's do this yes and just to be on the safe side there we go now i don't really know how many we have but let's hop in here it'll tell us 32,000 liters that's pretty dang good now where are we going where oh where oh where oh where oh where are we going there let us see Woo, that is nice we buy anything and that is 32 almost 3300 dollars and i think that's over by harris's garage if i am not mistaken up oh, boom there it is okay let's drive our butt down there now i am thinking that it might be about time to upgrade this tractor and give it just a wee bit more horsepower i've been noticing when i've been carting and like that trailer's full it just doesn't quite have the oomph to get up to speed very quick i mean it does so i don't have to upgrade it but it sure would be nice speaking of upgrades i did see that the uh update for this map is out but it does say it requires a new game save and with all of the fields that wouldn't be an issue no problem whatsoever but what the problem is going to be is all of our animals that is going to be an issue to try to switch over now once they are all in the reproduction and as far as growth states yeah growth states go that they're done then we could maybe update the map and we'd have to do a new save but right now it would be just too complicated so i guess we are going to have to stick with what we've got and it did say that it would fix the our help with the frame rate which would be very very nice because this this map is difficult on a person's frame rate i will attest to that but i think we're just gonna have to stick with where we're at and what we've got for right now with that let's get up here to our green beacon of light and see how much money we get it should be just a nice fat paycheck excuse me you know you should be wearing a jacket too you're gonna catch a cold and may we have a drum roll please not really i can't give you trouble but oh it's going it oh look at my goodness gracious look at it go oh my god we are up over three hundred thousand bucks 105 grand my goodness i do like lettuce lettuce is my friend holy cow that is nice so i think let me get this back to the farm and then we will go from there then we will do a little bit of shopping as far as what we want to buy i i definitely want some new fields field maybe not fields no s just just field i have no idea where i thought i was going this is not our trailer and we do not need it so i don't know why i was bringing it back to the farm oh well there we go that's all right at least they come and they will uh, they will collect so let's go in here and I, I really would like that forklift that would be nice but well we'll have to see later probably not but that's okay return yes gone now i did want to show you what became available so we go into here and field 42 is available we could take on that cotton harvest that is a that is a cool looking cotton baler not baler but bale picker upper i have never seen that before what is that that is it's got an arm do you have to reach out and grab it my, I might take it just for that. Well, not really just for that. I want the cotton too, but I, I think I think we're going to do it. Borrow items. Uh, yes, there we go. Well, it's, it's a done deal now. 
so we have forage what do we i know forage never gives us what we want what i want anyway yeah 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 soybeans canola so let's do this first no no yes okay Woo! i was really concerned that we would uh not be, not get all of our equipment but we did seem to what is this thing very interesting i don't i to be honest i don't know how this works well we will be figuring it out that's for sure now what i was wanting to do anyway okay so we have some options we can spend up to two something now there were quite a few that were in the twos 28 anything ready to harvest in the twos 41 uh oh that's 284 what is in there oh uh, that would be canola now how much was 20 field 29 233 that is right there we could do that and i think that's canola as well now i don't think it's ready to harvest mind you oh it is oh uh how much that was 233 right why don't we buy that it's only got one application of fertilizer but that's okay i mean that would be still all right and boom uh, that's so much money yes i want to buy it let me buy it why does it not let me buy it oh there's buy okay we got it oh there it is oh look at that under 100 grand again just like that all right let's we can harvest that right let's get this and i no not you get out of there get out of there let's grab this and i am going to at least get it on its way down to field 42 Oh, 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 I misjudged that opening. Oh, come on. Wow. I f didn't realize it had rear wheel steering as well. That is not easy to say. What is, what am I doing? I'm well, having a driving problem is what I'm doing. Turn, there we go. Nice and easy there. We're out the gate. What I think I want to do is I want to let some time go by. I would like to have the snow not on the ground. I don't know if that would affect yield. I know like rain does, so I would assume that snow is going to do the same thing. Oh, I knew I turned badly. Oh, and we have a train. So I don't know. Let's pull up our weather station and currently 35 at 11 is supposed to be 38 okay it's supposed to warm up it is 11. it should be it should be 38 degrees now there's no snow on the road that's it that's a plus but everything else has a nice layer of fresh powder but we also need to grab our harvester well, we can't really harvest our new canola field yet either. We can get it ready to go. Oh, we need a header. And I think we are going to buy this header. I mean, there's no sense in leasing it. We're going to need it over and over again. So we might as well buy it now. That will save us leasing cost. No. Oh, yeah. What are you doing? And nothing. Always got to check. Always have to check headers bum, bum, bum. so there's the dudes far 30 grand what they're awful proud of that should i no i shouldn't i really want to go for that but okay let's and the combinations we know let's take you no 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 add-ons we can put on here so let's let's buy it Oh, now we are under 50 grand, but that is the way it goes here at Farm Sam. I mean, you get the money, you spend the money. Hey, no more snow. Hot diggity. Now we have to figure out how to get that header. Well, let's get that header back after, after we get this guy going. So did I leave this running? Oh, I did. Okay. So I tried to set it up so that it would just go across. 
where the field curves and just get it. So let's see if we put that on a worker. Oh, they have to unfold. That's because I didn't do it. And that is a big old behemoth. Er, just bending and folding in there. You ready? Go, CP690. If that was loud, I'll try to calm it down in editing. But we are, uh, we are harvesting cotton. Now, I've got no idea how much we are going to end up with out of the field. But whatever we end up with will uh, be quite good. Now, speaking of that, did our spinnery do us any good? Is That's not the one I should be at. This is the one I should be at. And spinnery. And 1,500 liters. So I wonder what a pallet is. If we're storing 1,500, that would mean that the pallet is going to be more than 1,500 liters. What? No. So we need to get our header back to the field. So I... I don't know. Maybe I was trying to think of a way to do it without buying a header trailer, but maybe... Maybe we should just go ahead and buy a header trailer. And why am I walking down the field? That's not a field. That's a road. Why am I walking down a road? That's a better question. So if we go in here, uh, go back to headers, go back to here, and then... No, wait. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Now go combinations. I know I said I knew them, but... And a thousand dollars. Okay, I guess. I mean, what choice do we have? We bought the header. Are we gonna need a header trailer any more than once? I do have traffic turned off. Uh, let's just lease it. Just get it back to the farm. That's the big thing. And you know, we've got this guy right here. Why don't we just grab it, grab the header trailer, and get back. I think that worker is going to be just fine for a while. I have no idea how long they will go, but we will just let them do their thing while we do our thing, and we borrow their tractor and their fuel. Yeah, I like it that way. That is perfect. Well, I do see one small snafu, and that is uh, I don't have a harvester to pick this header up. But if y'all turn your eyes the other way, we will act like uh, they just loaded it up for us. Something like, well, that really wasn't very good. How about there? I guess. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just like that. That's what I meant to do. Glad they help. <laughs> okay, let's get this back to our farm. Now we have a harvester with a header pick that guy up bang him up now let's head over to our newest field i'm excited about having that i've been kind of eyeing that thing up the whole time since we even started okay here i need to get these stumps out of here i don't like looking at them excuse me crazy deer this thing on now let's just get this done Wow, that is so flipping orange. Oh my god. It's like hurt my eyeballs, orange. What I think I want to do is I want to get down here. Maybe we will just let's just put this on a worker right here. They're doing just fine. We've got 
Oh, I don't even know how many liters. We had like seven or 8,000 in here. Let's just wait here. Let's go. Oh, hey, wait, we have a bale. Looky there. That's not bad. I mean, they haven't gone far and we've already got one bale, which is, I don't even know how many liters, but I'm assuming it's quite a few. Can we see? What if we go right here? Uh, wow, 10,000 liters. That is, <laughs> that's quite impressive. So we should probably go ahead and get this guy, drop him down, take the Vulture, see if we can get it back to the cotton field. So let's park our trailer right here and then jump back in you. What are you doing? Okay, get, come here. I'll take over from here, thank you. Now I don't think I'm gonna run another speedy here. I think we just did one. I think one is probably sufficient. Oh, come on. Get over there and get all the crop, man. We are only at 40%. That's pretty good. That's good and bad. Well, canola doesn't fill up super fast, so you can't expect it. I just combined a deer. I just chopped it all up into little bits. Oops. <laughs> I swear these deer are psycho. They are completely nuts. Back down. Uh, ugh. It was not the best driving ever. Let's go ahead. Let's see if we can get this thing pounded out the rest of the way. We're going to make quite a bit off of this field. Let's pull up here and get the harvester emptied out. And then I want to run over and readjust the cotton harvester. I think we have a better angle that they can go at it. They kind of went above one of those little tracks, so now they're going a little bit slow. I think we can speed it up just a wee bit. Look at that. We should be close to 20,000 liters by the time it's all said and done. And I think we should be. Uh, I was going to just leave it, but I hate to. I don't want to do that. We might be in the way. That's going to be good. Let's get out of their way. All right, you go ahead and finish there. Beautiful. Well, do what they can. I don't know if they're going to finish. Where is it? Sheesh. Okay. So let's let them go. And I would like to do kind of the same thing. Maybe we can go right over here and get them about here. Where are they at? About 51%. I get so confused. They have so much. They have the top one and then they have the bottom one. And the top one is at 23% going fast and the bottom one's at 51%. I don't know if I'm smart enough to know how a cotton harvester works. And can you, I guess that's as fast as you go. Are they gonna make this little bend? Oh, look at that. We did good. Two rows, just enough to keep them going. I don't trust them, so I'm going to sit here and watch, make sure they do it right. That is just a beast of a machine. That is quite impressive. I just imagine the engineering that went into something like that. Of course, it went generation after generation. I think it was Eli Whitney who did the cotton gin. So uh, thank you, Eli. You uh, set this in motion. Very nice. Let's go back, go back. How are they doing? They are doing well. I want to get this finished up before we end the episode, but we are close. What are you doing? Okay, let's let's just take over here. Because they are a wee bit slow for my liking. I know, that's a surprise. Get that little tip. Just the tip. Just the tip. There. And this field is just about done. So we did all right with it. We didn't go crazy good with it, for sure. Only because there was only one application of fertilizer. But there was at least one application of fertilizer. So let's, yeah, get you. And I, I think that's under 4,500 liters still in there. Let's go find out. We might be able to get it all in this trailer. I mean, it doesn't matter. We don't have far to go. I'll probably just put it in the silo. So 
What is, what is that? Canola? So what is canola selling for? We are in, what are we in? January, I think. The cold, cold January. And, oh man, it took a dive. So 21, 24 is top. And we are at 1835. So do, uh, do I sell it now? I mean, it drops down to 14, so we are losing a few hundred bucks per thousand liters, three about $300 per thousand liters, and we have 20,000 liters. Oh, a little more, look at that. We just, no, come on, just get me there. 435, okay. So about 20,000 liters, so we're missing out on about 2,000. Whoa, what'd you do? What? What the heck is that? What? Uh, you know, I bet they backed their butt all the way down there and missed that. Why? Because good help is hard to find. That is why. So do I sell my... Oh, I didn't want to do that. Do I sell my canola? Wait. I messed up. I hit the button and now they missed that too. So let's fix this. And then we... There we go. Okay. So they didn't do quite as well as I was hoping for over here. Yeah, all right. Well, well, I mean, we had to know that there was going to be issues, didn't we? So do I sell canola or do I not sell canola? Oh, that is a... I mean, really, if I don't sell it now, we are looking at a year before we sell it. So let's sell it. I don't have anything else to do with canola. So let's go ahead and take it to, what was it? The American Grain? I say that like I know where I'm going. I have no idea where I'm going, but I just didn't want to seem like a buffoon. But I think it's a little late for that. So 1835. And let's, do I tag that? No, I hit the wrong button. No, go over here. Yes, that's where I want. Oh my goodness. And I'm, oh, oh, okay. All right, I know, I know where we're going. Out of the way there, little critter. These are some low lying branches through here. It is time to trim up these trees. My goodness, I can't see nothing. Okay, there we go. I drive bad enough when I can see, let alone when I can't see. This should give us a nice little shot of income. I mean, it's not gonna be huge, but it should be but uh I, well that was not quite two thousand bucks a liter so we should get around 30 some thousand bucks i don't know why i try to do math on the fly i always mess it up but either way we are going to be over seventy-five thousand. come on come on come on yeah there we go just hit the eighty thousand. Thirty-six grand pretty good I think we've done really well on this episode. Man, I man, I gotta say, we made all kinds of money and then we lost, all, or didn't lose it, but spent all kinds of money. And now we're back up to 80,000. I think our farm is finally hitting its stride. We're pulling in cash as fast as I can spend it. I mean, and that was one big chunk of money we spent there. But I think we've done extremely well. So with that, I want to thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please let me know. If you didn't, let me know why I suck. You know, either way, thanks all. Until next time, see ya.